Today we're at the Richmond Hill Middle School in Richmond Hill, Georgia. And today is a big event for us called STEAM Fest. It's part of the STEM or STEAM program here at Richmond Hill Middle School. What's going on behind us is probably one of the most exciting opportunities in education today. These middle school kids are building electric vehicles in the classroom and competing. And in the process, learning a lot about STEM, technology, and how to work as a team. So basically, we have a, um, a program here where kids come to my class a couple days a week in the morning, first thing in the morning, and they build these cars as a kit. And we were lucky that Coastal Electric helped us get these. They bought them all for us. Otherwise, we wouldn't be able to do this. Coastal's been doing this a long time. You know, part of what an electric cooperative does, we feel it's important to be involved in the community to support education, and this is a great example of that. The, the cars are shipped from England. When we get them, they come uh, disassembled. Quite a painstaking process of putting them together. Actually, students, actually, they do everything. I just kind of work as a coach and try to make sure that everything's done properly. So this is the first time that these students have gotten to build their cars and actually race them in competition outside of practice. So they actually have a two component race. They have their actual race heat that they're gonna do, which is what's going on right behind me right now. And then in a minute after this is done, they're gonna have a live presentation that they're gonna have to do in front of judges where they explain what they've done with the cars, how they built them, what they learned from the process, and potentially how they can apply that to their skills later on in their schooling and later on in their life and entry into the workforce. Students go on to become engineers, to become automobile mechanics, work on electric vehicles, design the next electric vehicle. The sky's the limit. The, the skills they learn from this, of course, relate directly to the technologies they're studying, but it applies to everyday life. When I grow up, I might do something like this where I build cars and also race them too. I don't have a driver's license. I'm 13 and uh, how we prepared was we drove it like almost every day to get ready for this race. It's fun to build it and then also see something that you built that is driving and going. A lot of kids nowadays are technologically uh, sound or they're, they're technologically savvy, but a lot of them lack skills in, when it comes to mechanical issues. In this case, we're trying to promote um, mechanics and as we know electric cars are becoming a big deal now and so we're just going along with this hopefully some of these kids will have something to do with um, electric cars in the future. It's terrific for the community you've probably heard that you know electric vehicles in general are, are having a big impact on on Georgia and more specifically you know this part of the coast with the new Hyundai plant coming where they'll be building electric vehicles but you know, this is engaging students, it's engaging their parents. It's a good thing for everyone to be involved in, just to get out and, and really see that electric transportation is a real thing. Thank you, Coastal Electric.